Hello and welcome to today's meditation, which is all about meeting exhaustion. <laughs> um, at the time of this, at the time of this recording, um, we're in the deep end of a pandemic. We've been, it's like we've been in a pressure cooker in so many ways. Um, for months now and it's all with good reason we are reshaping uh, as a civilization right we're reshaping as a collective and so um, some old paradigms are giving way but we're all being stretched like it doesn't matter if you're like heading into these collective changes, kicking and screaming, or if you're like, yeah, I've been waiting for this moment of huge transformation. Like we're all exhausted. Um, and so this, uh, this is really my gift to you. And this is what I was practicing just this morning. So uh, get comfortable. Um, if you're sitting, uh, you have a couple options, right? Like either connect with the earth through your feet. Right now I've, I'm, I'm seated in a chair, but my feet are on the floor. Um, or you can sit directly on the earth. Um, if you are feeling super tired this morning, I did my meditation lying down. I was like, I woke up tired. <laughs> so, um, yeah, like whatever... Uh, really give yourself the grace and I really encourage you to do this always not just now always check in with your body and ask like do I need to do I just need to lie down for five minutes do I need to be outside in the sunshine like what immediately helped this morning for example because I woke up already feeling heavy so I meditated you know like showered did my did my stuff meditated got outside in the sunshine that helped a lot yeah so we're surrounded by tools we're surrounded by support as soon as I got outside and like heard the bird song like our weather our our winged angels right that are constantly singing to us like reminding us like it's okay <laughs> it's okay ah, so find that comfortable position I've got my hands resting in my lap uh, if you want, you can, I often like touch my middle finger to my thumb and like a little, it's like, almost like, uh, like a never ending circle of energy, right? It's just about maintaining that energetic connection, but truly like do what feels right for you right now. If it feels like you want to connect with your heart space and like pray your hands in front of your heart chakra is where you want to be, like really tune in, ask your body, ask your intuition, right? There is no one size fits all. There really, really isn't. Sometimes we meditate to connect at the third eye. Sometimes we meditate to connect at that root chakra of just grounding, just earthing, just like coming back into the body. It's not always about going out and connecting, right? Um, I mean, we're all always connected, infinite loops. So this is what today's meditation is. And this is what I did this morning was I just started an infinity loop. I started first, like from my heart chakra, like just kind of out into space and back in and out. And I was just kind of like scooping. So this is what you're, you know, just breathe naturally. And this is what we're doing. Like as we inhale bringing in all that energy that we have around us. And then as you exhale, release that tiredness, the any heaviness that you're feeling, any charge that you're carrying, right? And just, just do that for a little bit, right? Let's inhale. Oh, the abundant sunshine, the leaves on the trees, whatever is going on, right? Just that abundance and that wonderful ease, right? <sighs> Exhale to release any tension, any pain, any heaviness, any tiredness, just let it go. Really 
feel the blessing of the oxygen reaching all parts of your lungs, all the way down in, like deep into the pockets, right, of your lungs. Let your breath be like that infinity loop, pulling in fresh oxygen and energy and prana, like the energy of the universe. <sighs> Exhaling, releasing. And if you feel, as I did this morning, that in that release, some tears wanna come, let them come, my loves, okay? Tears are a tremendous, um, escape valve for our most intense emotions and they are a blessing okay I call them teargasms just let them come and go right so if you're feeling oh you just want to let some of that oh my god I can feel them coming again right just like feel that wonderful energy coming in release the heaviness release any sadness you might be feeling. It's all okay. I'm not even going to tell you, like, you know, breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. Um, in general, that is a nice practice. But honestly, do what's feeling right for you right now. You know better than anyone. You know better than your doctor. You know better than me. You know better than any guru, right? You know what is right for you in this moment. Like even when we connect, as we do in meditation with our guides, it's really us, right? It's really your deepest knowing, your, you know, you can call it your future self, which is really now because time is an illusion, yeah. When you feel complete with that practice, just in with light, out the tiredness, in with oxygen, out with any tears, in with the prana, out with any charge, right? So we're just in and out like this, beautiful. Yeah. When you feel complete with that, then feel free to pause me until you do, right? And then we'll go into the next section. I do that with you a few times. Feel free to vocalize if that helps. Very often we hold in our throat, right? So let it go. Huh. Take that infinite loop and we're just going to bring it in so that it's more aligned with our chakras, right? Just to kind of almost like close that loop, right? We're kind of going out and in, out and in. And then like you're pulling in that gorgeous prana, like a crown. Now the top of the figure eight or infinity loop is like through your crown chakra and down, all the way down to your root chakra, right? So we've just taken, so if you can imagine, we've just taken your, your figure eight or your infinity symbol that was going like this, and we're just bringing it in and like melding it with the body, right? Because we, we are like, no joke, y'all. Like we are the universe. The universe is us, okay? Um, your body is a microcosm of the macrocosm and so it's all connected. We are all connected and we are connected with this gorgeous planet and our environment, right? So part of what's going on when we feel exhausted is that we feel alone and just know that you are not alone. You are never alone, right? There's still, I'm still releasing more, right? And it's okay, and it's all good. It's so good, so good. Just let it go. Ah, so 
as you shift that infinity loop. And now we're feeling it. Inhale up through the crown chakra. Mm. Exhale down into the root chakra. So really allowing Mama Earth, our connection with the planet, all the way down into the center of the planet. Feel how we are so supported and how anything that you still need to release, you can just release right into the earth. She can absorb it. You're like playthings on her surface in many ways, right? She is an ancient wise being. She can handle it. Yeah. She can help us transmute it. Because really it's us transmuting this energy. This infinity loop, okay? So continue breathing. And you're going to breathe in. Oh, it just passed 1111 in the video. Nice. Breathe in through the crown chakra. Exhale. Let that energy pass down through the root chakra, okay? Just feel that divine circulation, okay? And then anything that you are still needing to release, just let it, it's like, as it hits the top and the bottom, really like release it down into the earth. Up, ah, pull down. Yeah, that gorgeous energy. Pull up the energy from the earth, right? Feel that. So this figure eight, it's contained only in so far as we are contained, which we are not, right? So as you're tracing that figure eight, I want you to really connect with the fact that your body is not the finite vessel that it appears to be, right? We actually have energy centers that continue up, up, up. We are able to connect up and out and down, right? So, and in all directions, right? We're not, you know, unidirectional. But really just what we're doing right now is recycling that energy. We have the capacity, the capability of taking this energy that feels like, almost like, um, it's almost like a, like a, like a, 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 like a water processing plant where it just like, like cleans out all the stuff, filters out all the stuff and then like, ah, like brings in fresh and clean. So it's that same idea of just, we have the capacity in our energy centers to take this charge and transmute it, to take the exhaustion and transmute it. And that's what we're doing, right? We're releasing it but just into our outer, bigger self, right? And then we're bringing it back in, like refreshed, yeah? So I just want you to really, as you're breathing into the infinite loop that is you, I want you to recognize that you are a creator, a creatrix. You absolutely have the capacity to shift and move this energy, right? You are not alone in that. And that's why we tap the outer tapestry and earth, right? All these beings that are around us. And um, mm, go ahead and continue breathing that infinite loop for now. So what I'm feeling is how the loop starts like within my chakras and with each pass through and as it the pass through is your heart okay that's where the cross happens and as it passes through you can feel that infinity symbol getting bigger right reaching up and out and more and down is that do you know what i mean up and over and down and around like feel how expansive that is. So we're like, we went from here to in, and now we're expanding up and out and down and out, right? Okay, up and out and down and out. Feel that loop.
take it as expansive as you want to take it. Touch the planets and the stars, right? Touch every human being on the planet and send them love. And receive that love in exchange, in return. start to like shrinky dink right we always stay connected right and now we're going to just take that expansive we're going to come back in to our bodies because there's a reason why we're here on this physical plane right in this um in this in this costume in this outfit <laughs> to do our work here on the planet feel as that energy like comes back in, the concentration of it, how you hold, can hold the energy of the universe in your body. It's in your DNA, my loves, it's in your cells. Yeah, that's how powerful you are. Take a few last breaths. eyebrows <laughs> when you feel ready if you had your eyes closed you know you can slowly open them soft gaze yeah welcome back and have a wonderful wonderful day from my heart to yours I love you you are not alone and uh, we're all we're all doing this together Sending you big hugs from my heart to yours. I love you. Take what you need and pass it on. <laughs>